here's a quick run through of taking care of the fish. Try not to make you seasick here. Start by opening this valve in the lower tank straight up and down. That'll drain the grow bed into the bottom. Goldfish get this food once a day, about that much. Flappy get this food at least once a day. If you can do it twice, once in the morning, once in the evening, that would be great. A little trickier. I'm just going to add some until they slow down their eating. About like that. From this bed right here, I usually grab one of the little algae clumps like this. Just drop it into the tank with the tilapia. They'll snack on that. Make sure you feed them first before you stick your fingers in there, otherwise they will go after your fingers. You can give some to the goldfish too if you want. Then I just test the water using this kit. Grab this dropper. I'm going to fill one of these vials up to the line. See the water's up to the line there. And then you're gonna grab this one right here. Oh, it's not focusing. Uh, it's pH six to seven point six. Anyway, two drops. Two. Shake this. And you can see there'll be a color to the water. I'm going to compare that with the back of this book. pH 6 to 7.6. You can see these colors. You're just going to compare this. So you can see right now it's around a 6, 6.1. We want to try to keep it around the 6.4 to 6.6 .6 range. To raise that pH, we're either going to add calcium hydroxide or potassium hydroxide. Basically, I just switch back and forth each day. One day I'll do one, one day I'll do the other. Grab this bucket. This barrel just has rainwater in it. So just grab a bit of rainwater. Yesterday I added the potassium, to, so today I'm going to add the calcium.
potassium and the calcium are caustic, so you do want to be careful not to really get it on you. I've just got a teaspoon in there, and I'm going to put about a half a teaspoon in the water. So about like that. Make sure you feed the fish before you add this to the water, just in case there's anything that doesn't dissolve. I don't want them to try to eat it because it's caustic. Just stir that until it dissolves. 30 seconds maybe. And then add about half it to the bottom tank. Up with the tilapia. And then reset this valve, there's a scratch, just line up the two scratches. You'll see them right there. Just line those up so that the water level will come back up in the grow bed. And that's it.